The James Webb Space Telescope, often referred to as Webb, is a cutting-edge astronomical observatory set to succeed the Hubble Space Telescope. Webb promises to unveil the mysteries of the cosmos with its advanced technology, providing unprecedented insights into the universe's origins and evolution. Here are 10 new James Webb Space Telescope images just released to the public. Number one, huge star about to go supernova NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has just provided us with these stunning images of a dying star. NASA released JWST photos of WR-124, a rare wolf rayet star in the constellation Sagittarius located approximately 15,000 light years from Earth. Massive stars race through their life cycles, and only a small percentage of them go through a brief wolf rayet phase before exploding, making Webb's detailed observations of this rare phase valuable to astronomers. According to NASA experts, WR-124 is around 30 times the mass of our Sun and has released more than 10 solar masses of gas and dust into space to yet. All that dust, however insignificant it may appear, is tremendously important to astronomers. Dust is integral to the workings of the universe. It shelters forming stars, gathers to help form planets, and serves as a platform for molecules to form and clump together, including the building blocks of life on Earth. NASA scientists noted in the image description. Despite the many essential roles that dust plays, there is still more dust in the universe than astronomers' current dust formation theories can explain. Number two, coldest interstellar ice ever seen NASA's newest satellite telescope is not only allowing astronomers to see further into the universe, but it is also reaching colder temperatures than scientists have previously achieved. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST or Webb, the most powerful space observatory to date, has peered deep into a dense molecular cloud and discovered a rich diversity of pure interstellar ice, including a variety of chemicals essential for life. These discoveries, made at minus 440 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 263 degrees Celsius, are the coldest ices yet discovered. Webb investigated a neighborhood known as Chameleon of Worms by scientists. It's one of the closest star-forming areas, located in the southern constellation of Chameleon and roughly 500 light-years away from Earth, with dozens of pockets alive with young stars. The region is part of a family of dark molecular clouds that are so dense with gas and dust that visible light from background stars cannot penetrate them. Number 3. Spies Baby Stars Dancing in Swirling Gas and Dust The James Webb Space Telescope continues to perform admirably. This image, released today, depicts the arms of the barred spiral galaxy NGC 1433, which are teeming with young stars that can be seen impacting the clouds of gas and dust around them. The image was captured as part of the Physics at High Angular Resolution in Nearby Galaxies project, which includes over 100 researchers from around the world. One of the first science programs of the James Webb Space Telescope is to study 19 spiral galaxies for FANGs using its mid-infrared instrument, which can see through gas and dust clouds that other forms of imaging cannot. One of the first science programs of the James Webb Space Telescope is to study 19 spiral galaxies for FANGs using its mid-infrared instrument, which can see through gas and dust clouds that other forms of imaging cannot. Number 4. Mesmerizing Wreath-like Galaxy Spiral galaxy NGC 7469 whirls around an active galactic nucleus 220 million light years distant in the constellation Pegasus. It's one of our universe's better studied galaxies, but the James Webb Space Telescope has recently produced one of the most comprehensive images of the wreath shaped galaxy yet seen. Because NGC 7469 is facing us, astronomers may observe it for its whole 90. 000 light year lifetime. It's AGN, the brilliant region at its center where dust and gas light up as they are eaten by the galaxy's supermassive black hole, is of particular interest. The structure isn't rare, but NGC 7469 contains a starburst ring barely 1,500 light years away from the AGN, an unusually near distance. Scientists have found it challenging to gaze inside the AGN and its surrounding starburst because there is so much material crammed into such a compact region. Webb's ultra-sensitive infrared imaging equipment have transformed all of that. Number 5. 
Hot, gritty clouds in skies of huge exoplanet with two suns NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has made another spectacular discovery. The pioneering observatory just peered directly into the atmosphere of VHS 1256b, a giant exoplanet with two suns, and discovered a roiling world with turbulent clouds made of silicates, similar to sand on Earth, as announced in a recent article published in Astrophysical Journal Letters. This report of unpleasant but fascinating exoplanet weather is based on JWST's unique capacity to acquire detailed spectra of objects in space, allowing scientists to determine their compositions. VHS 1256b is approximately 40 light years away from Earth. It's an odd world, unlike our own blue globe. It's around 19 times more massive than Jupiter, orbits two stars instead of one, and takes nearly 10,000 years to orbit its host stars. Number six, ghostly light of interstellar space. The dim light emitted by orphan stars that live between galaxies in galaxy clusters is featured in the Space Telescope's first deep field photograph. The James Webb Space Telescope's first deep field image of the universe has allowed scientists to analyze the dim, almost ghostly light from orphan stars that dwell between galaxies in galaxy clusters. These stars are not gravitationally connected to galaxies and drift into intergalactic space as a result of the huge tidal forces generated between galaxies and clusters. The light released by these stellar orphans is known as intracluster light, and it is so weak that it is only 1% as bright as the darkest sky seen from Earth. Number seven, iconic image reveals a stellar surprise. When scientists first saw magnificent images of the Southern Ring Nebula captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, they realized they needed to reconsider their assumptions about the uninteresting object. The Southern Ring Nebula, located approximately 2,000 light years from Earth in the constellation Vela, which is visible in the southern sky, was one of the James Webb Space Telescope's early science targets, and a portrait was among the photos initially given to the world in July. Webb's predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, had previously imaged the nebula, also known as NGC 3132. However, Hubble's photos, while magnificent, failed to portray the full story of this dust cloud, which arose from the implosion of a dying star the size of the sun only 2,500 years ago. Number eight, Pandora's Cluster, in stunning image with help from Einstein. In Greek mythology, Pandora's curiosity leads her to open a container that releases all of the world's horrors and sorrows. We can only hope that the James Webb Space Telescope did not do precisely that when it zoomed in on a region of space known as Pandora's Cluster, using a phenomenon predicted by Einstein in 1915. The new JWST image reveals previously unknown features about the region, as well as the merger of three already big clusters into an even larger mega cluster of galaxies. The moniker for this part of Pandora's Cluster, properly known as Abel 2744, comes from the observation of a variety of various structures inside it. Number nine, James Webb Space Telescope just found an asteroid by total accident, its smallest object, yet a tiny asteroid was detected by the James Webb Space Telescope. The space rock is roughly the size of Rome's Colosseum and could be the tiniest object discovered by the Space Telescope since it was sent into space at the end of 2021. Though the James Webb Space Telescope has made headlines for discovering gigantic astronomical objects as far away as billions of light years, the new discovery reveals the powerful instrument's unexpected utility far closer to home. Even more astonishing, the team that discovered the 330 to 660 foot asteroid used data obtained to calibrate the mid infrared instrument, which was never designed to discover new asteroids. Number 10. Faint Galaxy Pearls NASA's James Webb Space Telescope continues to astound, this time with an incredible image that reveals previously undiscovered galaxies near the North Ecliptic Pole. The image is one of the few medium-depth, wide-field photographs of our universe, and it depicts thousands of galaxies across a dizzying range of distances, stretching to the distant regions of the universe while also containing stars from our own Milky Way. The new image from the Prime Extragalactic Areas for Rayonization and Lensing Science program, taken by the James Webb Space Telescope, also shows a number of interacting galaxies. 
The glittering sight was caught by Webb's near-infrared camera, which covers 2% of the region covered by the full moon. The image was created by combining eight different hues of near-infrared light taken by NearCam with three different colors of ultraviolet and visible light collected by the Hubble Space Telescope 